So uh, in just a few minutes here, I'm going to be hopping on a phone call. There's my cat Michelle in the background. I'm going to be hopping on a phone call with someone that's trying to hack into my uh, Facebook account. For those that don't know, about four years ago, um, I clicked a, a few wrong links. I fell for a scam, and these scammers, hackers, whatever you want to call them, they got into my Facebook page, and I was very fortunate. I was lucky enough to be able to get in contact with someone from Facebook and get that page back. But uh, it happens every day where these these bitches, we can call them that. That's the right term for these, you know. We can say worse things about them, but these bitches, they, they, uh, they write you an email. And for the most part, they're really bad with grammar. Um, they, they have been, I can give them credit, they have been evolving uh, where they can make you kind of fall for the scam easier. Uh, you, you, you pretty much, you, you know when you can spot it, but as I would say like five, maybe even ten years from now, it's going to be much harder to spot these hacks. So I kind of want to bring light to it on today's stream. Um, I usually stream on both Facebook and YouTube, but today I'm just on YouTube because if I went through Facebook, this hacker might see that I'm streaming, about to catch this bitch in the act. Um, I had a call with another one last week. I didn't uh, stream it because I was kind of, you know, getting familiar with the ropes for this exact moment. So let's just hope, uh, let's just hope he's not watching this YouTube because then he's not going to make this, uh, make this Zoom call with me. But yeah, for anyone that's just now tuning in, we are going to be having a uh, conversation with someone that's trying to hack into my Facebook page. So what they do is they make you, they make it seem like you're going to be having this awesome uh, collaboration with a podcast, and they're going to be paying you two thousand to three thousand dollars. And this podcast is sponsored by Nike. They say all this bullshit, but it's all false. It's all fake. But they kind of butter it up and make it look like it's legit. Um, but it, it's not legit. It's very far from it. But again, in due time, they can involve their craft. You know, it's just right now they're a bunch of idiot bitches. And uh, in about one minute, we're gonna have this conversation with them. I hope everyone out there is having a good day. Before I have this conversation, let me get a little fuel. Crack open this Celsius here. Cheers, guys. Hopefully, this goes well. But this is an ongoing thing. People work really hard for their pages. And uh, with all these new creators, young creators coming into the scene, some might not know how to spot it. They might see, oh, so-and-so want to pay me $2,000 for an awesome podcast sponsorship, not knowing that if they click the wrong link or uh, if they follow these steps that I'm about to walk you through on this conversation, then they're going to get hacked. And pretty much what it is, before even going into this call, um, I can't, so he's going to get me on a Zoom and he's pretty much going to tell me this awesome opportunity that came my way. And then he's going to like ask if I can share my screen and I'm going to of course say no, but what he's going to do is walk me through the back end of the Facebook uh, creator page and pretty much what they're trying to get at is they're trying to have me give access to them so they can take control over the admin on my Facebook. And then once they get control of Facebook, they kick me out. They kick you out of your own page. So uh, that's what's going to be happening on this call. Uh, of course, I'm gonna play dumb. I'm not gonna like just go right to like the throat and like, hey, like, yeah, you little you bitch. I might eventually get to that point, but the main thing here is to waste as much of their time as possible because one minute longer with me is one more minute longer where they can't, you know, hack into someone else's account. So we're about to get them. All right. Hey, hope you had a great, uh, a good surgery. And uh, it is 2.01 right now, so I'm going to go to Zoom. And, you guys, we're going to be playing stupid. Of course, we know what they're doing. We know what they're getting at. I, I, I can't follow their steps. I'm going to act like I am. So the trick here is to make it seem like I'm following their steps because they're going to keep asking questions. Hey, did you do this? Did you do this? You should share your screen so I can make sure you did what you did. And they're trying to inch closer and closer to, like, me giving them access to my page. So that's the whole... Uh, run down here now let's get to zoom in with this bitch and this is like a big man this is of course they're out of uh before i even hop on call look i've been through the you know the ringer with them before they're not from the united states they're very far from it and they're just they're idiots man they're idiots but they get away with a lot of it you know they get 
the hack probably a good amount of pages every single day. And I, again, I was very fortunate four years ago to get my page back because I went on to make a living for about two years on my Facebook page after I got my page back. So it just sucks to know that people are coming in trying to take away what's yours like this, you know? So this is my way to help spread awareness. And maybe this is something we can keep going. You don't think they're watching. I hope they're not watching me live. So again, I'm usually on my uh, Facebook and YouTube streaming. They're trying to get my Facebook page, not my YouTube page. So I'm hoping they're not smart enough to check my YouTube and see what's going on. But they they could be. This call might not even happen. He might uh he might have wised up and checked the YouTube. But I'm gonna hopefully say he didn't. I just gotta pull up this email and uh, we'll be on our way. And if he did wise up and see the stream, then I can't catch him live in the act anymore. But I just think doing it live is just so much more fun. Fuck it, we're doing it live! All right, there is the the Zoom ID. Okay, join. Here we go, guys. We're going in. We're going in. Woo! And uh, when you see this red thing, that means I'm on mute and he can't hear me. So whenever we're red... Oh, here we go. Let me test my speaker. Hello? 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 Hello. Hey, how's it going? Can you hear me? Oh, shit, I'm up. Hello, hello, can you hear me? Uh, yes, I can hear you. Hey, Steve, how are you doing? I am great, man. I've been looking forward to this call. Uh, hell yeah, man. Great to be talking right, to you right perfect. now. Perfect. Finally, we are on a call. Okay, this is Richard here, manager of Mr. Tahir More. Really nice to get in touch with you. Uh, sorry, okay. say that again. I said, like, this is Richard here, manager of Mr. Tahir More. Really nice to get in touch with you. Yes, Richard. Awesome to get in touch with you. I'm just here by myself. Uh, my wife is my manager, but she's at work right now. She typically doesn't let me use the internet when she's not home, but I told her this awesome opportunity, and she's like, fuck it, you can you can go live. But, uh, yeah, we looked over the podcast, and we're just super excited to have this opportunity, you know? Uh, perfect, perfect. All right, let me quickly pull up my calendar, and let me have a look. Mm, we are all set on 25th of January for the podcast, right? Yes. Yeah, and it will be on Thursday, 7 to 8 p.m. Eastern time zone. Yep, that's perfect. All right. So, Steve, let me know, like, what you have in your mind. Uh, you can feel free to ask anything you have in your mind regarding the podcast. Uh, if, if you don't have anything in the mind, then we can, like, move forward to the process, like how to set up the things at your end. Okay, so my biggest concern, not my, not really a concern, but my biggest thing is that um, the amount we discussed for what I'm getting paid for this podcast would be $3,000, right? Exactly. So I was talking to my wife, and mm -hmm. she was saying how since it's sponsored by Nike, is there any way we can bump up, bump that amount up any any amount? Uh, actually, uh, Steve, uh, this podcast is not directly sponsored. Like, it's not uh, Nike is not directly involved in this podcast, Okay. Uh, because Mr. Tahir More is a brand ambassador for Nike for more than a decade. So whatever he does is actually like sponsored by Nike. So this podcast is sponsored by Nike like uh, uh, for uh, Mr. Tahir More. Okay. But Nike is not directly paid. This is a personal invitation directly from Mr. Tahir to you and other participants to participate in his podcast. But we can do uh, something. How about if you can like participate in two episodes? Can you do that? Uh, wait, for two episodes for the same amount of $3,000? No, then we can, like, surely we can increase the amount. Oh, yeah, if we can increase the amount, I'm I'm all in 100% on, oh, on okay. doing two oh, episodes. About, Fuck yeah, oh, dude. About 8,000 8, bucks for two episodes. 80,000? No, it's 8,000. Oh, my God, I must just shit my pants, man. 80,000 would have been life changing. Me and my wife are trying to save up for a house, and 80,000 is life-changing money <laughs> not really <laughs> okay. okay so eight eight thousand for two episodes yes exactly 
Oh, yeah, that's okay. Perfect. I am on. Yeah, I'm on board 100%. All right. So 25th is lot for you. You can pick any other day you want. We have open window on 28th, 29th, 30th. And let me, let me check 20th. my uh, availability. What you said either 30. What uh, what dates the next one is available? It's 28th, 29th. I would say 28. I can't do it. Uh, but 29th, I, I'm all free all day. Yep, I can do that one. Uh, okay, so you are all set on 25th and 29th of January for the podcast, okay? Perfect. And it's like $8,000. It's 8000 not 80 <laughs> Okay. Okay, yeah, 8000 uh, Yep, I, uh, I got yeah. that down. Now, is there any yeah. way I can get the upfront payment now before exactly. any uh, I... any further steps are made? Mm -hmm. Let me let me guide you. Like you get paid well before the event, and you fully get paid the fully amount before the podcast. Uh, like you get paid forty eight hours before the podcast on twenty third of January, you get paid uh, fully amount for two episodes. And once you oh have my, the payment that's... in the account, only then you can participate in this podcast. Okay. Okay. That's awesome. So that's awesome you... that you guys do it. Do the payment earlier. But like yeah. I, dur during the during this call, am I able to get you know any amount like up front just to show that trust that the, that the trust is there? Uh actually, like you know, like who Mr. Tahir is, the Tahir Mori. He's a public figure. He's a famous person here in the U.S. You know, like every participant who are participating in this podcast, they all are public figure. They have like blue verified badge on their Facebook fan pages, and I guess like you personally know many of them. Uh, in person, yes. like uh, they all are public figures, just like you, and some some have like almost three million followers on their Facebook fan pages. So um, if we uh, talk about the pro uh, uh, like uh, the trust issue, we uh, will sign a contract with you after the call, and we will uh, send you the half amount if you want, and we can pay you like the fully amount because our policy is every artist will be get paid forty eight hours before the podcast. That's why I'm oh. telling you to like you get paid forty eight hours before the date you choose for the podcast. Okay. Okay, okay yeah, that and I'm, also I will let you know like who will be joining with you. Uh I will send their contact number, their Facebook pages link. You can easily get in touch with them. Like beside you there will be two more artists will be joining with you on the day of the podcast like on 25th and 28th. Uh, sorry, 29th. And yep. um uh the Tahir will be like hosting this podcast Mr. Tahir. And uh, beside you and him, there will be two more artists, and they are like public figure. They are well known. Do you and, know the uh, the I artist? Just, just so I can do my research and kind of have more conversation back and forth. Yeah. I kind of want to. I want to look into who's yes. going to be in the call with us. Do you know who those names are going to be? Yes, I will send all the details. I will send their contact number, their Facebook pages link, their profile link, so you can easily get in touch with them just to make a good chemistry well before the event. Okay. Okay, so uh, Steve, uh, let me know, like, have you ever done any online podcast through your Facebook fan page before, or this is the first time you're doing this? Uh, I have a podcast, but I've never done it live on Facebook before. This will be my first time. Uh, okay, just like a live uh, on Facebook. It's the same thing. But are you connecting with me through your laptop at the moment? Yes, I am. Yes, I am. I, I saw your email, and you, you said to make sure that I'm on my uh, computer to make things easier, and oh, that's what I'm doing. Cause it's all about just making it flow smooth, baby, smooth like butter. Exactly. I really appreciate it. So oh, hell yeah. Share, uh, uh, let me quickly share my screen with you, and okay. then let me show you like, what exactly you need to have a look at your end to join this podcast. Can you see my screen? I can see your screen, yep. Perfect. Can you see this online event at my end? I can is exactly what you need to have a look at your end actually it's a facebook feature in the pandemic facebook launched it through that feature you can easily go live to your page simultaneously with other artists from different places from different part of the world at the same time so if you already have that feature activated at your end then we're good to go like we simply send you the invitation to join the podcast and with the help of one click you can simply join it and it will automatically go live to your page as well as mr tahir page as well as other artist pages at the same time from different places from different part of the world okay so this is the thing you need to like double check it at your end if you already have that feature activated at your end then we're good to go like we let simply me, uh, send you the invitation and hmm? oh, sorry let me uh, double check real quick yeah so you can check this thing at your end if you have it i will give you a real test run right away 
If you don't have it, I will let you know like how to create it from Facebook. And how do I how do I get to that page again? You need to simply go to your normal Facebook fan page, the home page. Okay. Yep. And then and then when I'm at the home page, where do I go? Um, at the left side, you can see professional dashboard, right? Yes. Uh, underneath that, you can see Meta Business Suite. You need to click on the Meta Business Suite. Click the Meta Business Suite. Oh, there it is. Okay. Yep. There it is. I'm loading into the suite. Okay, I'm at the suite now. Uh, and okay. then all the way, all the way down from the left bottom, you can see help. All the way left from the bottom, ad, under ads. Um, all the way down from the left to bottom, you can see help. Help? Yep. Click on yes, the help. I, I see. Yep, I see help. Yep. Okay, click clicked on help. help. And it will show you the option you need to click on go to business manager. Business manager. Um, and it's going to be under. Oh, there it is. Clicked it. Mm -hmm. I, I'm there now. Okay, again. In all the way down from the left to bottom, you can see a gear icon, a small gear icon. It says like business settings. Uh, I see it. Yeah, there, there, see, there's a lot of steps here before I even uh, get paid. That's why I wanted to have this upfront payment because this is going to take probably an hour to get this set up. No, no, no. It's easy to set up. I, I just uh, walk you through the process like step by step. To show you everything it's easy to do that you can simply visit it by putting like business.facebook.com slash setting okay it's a back end of the facebook you need to simply have a look if you have the online event then we get we are good to go i do have the online yeah it's all there because i've been um partner with facebook in the past for uh for many years so i have everything my my account is crystal clear hmm. there's no there's no warrants out for my facebook or anything like that uh, okay, uh, so you need to like let me know what email is connecting with your online event. So I will give you a test for that right away, just to check like everything is up and running. What, you need to, you need to have my email. Uh, the same email, right? Well, that's kind of personal information for that. You know, is that is that needed for this next step? No, actually, like the online event is connected with your email. The Correct. Personal, like, like the email address. Yeah. In which you get the invitation from the Facebook. So if you already have that feature activated at your end, then you need to like let me know the email. I will send you the invitation uh, to give you a test run, just to uh, give you a, a like just to check like everything is up and running at your end to join the podcast. Because on the day of the podcast, I will send you the invitation, just like a Zoom invitation. You can simply click on it, and it will automatically go live to your page as well as other artists' pages. And I, and I can, I can trust this link if I click it. Uh, it's just like a Zoom link. You can also get the notification on your uh, personal Facebook, uh, uh, like profile, just like uh, from the Facebook. It's ah. just like Facebook Live. Once you go live, your followers get the notification. Like uh, uh, Steve is go live on the Facebook. It's something like that. Once, uh, like, Pyro is inviting you for the podcast, you get the notification on your Facebook fan page. Either you get the uh, link from us, either you get the notification from the Facebook itself. It says, like, Pyro is inviting you to, like, participate in his podcast. Can you join it or not? This is as simple as, uh, well, like, it's a Facebook process, you know? Is, is it okay if I call my manager real quick? AKA my wife. She's at work right now, but she knows I'm on this call. I just want to confirm oh, yeah. with her. If... Yeah, right. You can do that. Hope. Okay, if, I'm going to call her. Can, like, you can, like, loop her on a Zoom call with me. Well, I'm just going to call her real quick on my uh, yeah. Go ahead. Go on ahead. the phone. I'm just going to mute my mic real quick, but I'll I'll be still be in the call with you real quick. Okay. Okay, go ahead. Take your time. Can you hear me? Can you hear me? You fucking bitch. You can't hear me. Bitch, I ain't calling anybody, bitch. I ain't calling anybody. Where I'm mute, I think, right? You can't hear me? Can you hear me, dude? No, yeah, that's right. You fucking can't hear me, you scamming bitch. <laughs> You're not fooling anybody. Well, you probably are, but you fuck. You think I'm calling my wife right now? <laughs> oh, my God, guys. Yeah, but... uh. 
I'm probably gonna let him know here soon. I'm, I'm gonna try to get him on video to confirm he's not AI or anything. So I'm gonna get back to the call and let him know that my wife gave the A-OK, -okay, but she wants to make sure that he's a human. Hey, can you hear me? Uh, yes, I can hear you. Hey, yes, okay, sorry, sorry about that. I just talked to uh, my manager and she said all is good, but she wants to make sure that, uh, cause there's like people that do AI scams. So she wants me to like, make sure you're a real person. Is there any way I can like, we can get like on a video where I can see you or is it? Yes, is that why not? Why not? You can turn on the camera. Okay, see, I, I told her that this seems legit, so. <laughs> all right. Let me turn on my camera. So, hey. Hey. He hello. Hello. Okay. Hey, then I can't he uh, see you. Um. How do I? Let me see how I get the, the um. Go to the zoom. Go to zoom. Okay. And, and then start video. I click my my name or what? You can click on video. Click on video. Um. I see. oh start video. Yep. Is it going? Uh, yeah, but uh, it's, it's all black. Ah, uh, I don't see, I see. My wife does most of my uh, camera setup for me. I don't really, I don't, I don't really know, know much. My wife, my wife does a lot of stuff for me. But uh, no, also, I wish your wife will be there. On, on a uh, can I can I let you? So whenever I get these awesome deals, I always go live. I'm currently live on my YouTube page. Is that okay? Uh, yep. And we have we have a good amount of viewers right now. Nothing too crazy. We have about forty eight people watching live right now to kind of get this awesome interaction and and help celebrate this this awesome opportunity. All right, perfect. So uh, you need to like simply go to the business settings and you need to like uh, let me know uh, if you have the online event or how about if you can like share the screen with me. You can see my screen. I can see yours. So it's easy for me to like kind of guide you at your end. Uh, hold on. See, I just don't know how to really do much of anything on here. Uh, let me let me guide you. Go to the Zoom. Okay, go to going to Zoom. Okay, in the middle of uh, at the bottom middle line, you can see share screen or share content. Click on it. Hold on. Um. Fuck! Where the hell is it? My computer's like free, my computer's like free, my computer's like freezing up on me right now. But I'm a lot of people on my YouTube are saying this is a hack, it's a scam. You're gonna try to get into my account and and take it over and and get admin control and kick me out. Is that true? Not really. Well, everyone, everyone on here, we almost have a thousand viewers now, and every viewer is saying this is a hack, it's a scam, it's not, it's not legit. Oh, let me have a look. What's your, what's, uh, what's your YouTube? My YouTube is youtube.com slash Steve Cardinal. Oh, we're back down to 50 now. It keeps flo going up and down, but a lot of the comments came in saying that this isn't legit. Okay. And I think, and I think the reason my, my video couldn't connect is because I got a video on my stream right now. So on the stream, you can see oh, me. There is, there is no video such like that you're talking. There's no video. Well, it's, uh, I'm live right now. I'm live on my uh, YouTube. Did you go to the right page? Yep. You have like 4.9 million followers. Yep. That's right. me. That's me. Yep. And if you go to the page, it will say I'm live. And it will say phone call with someone that's trying to hack my page. I got you, baby. I caught you. Don't don't try to hide from it now. Look, let's talk. Let's talk this out. Why are you doing this? I'm here. I'm here. Why are you doing this, man? Are you get paid a good amount of money? Like, oh, where'd you go? Why'd you leave? Why'd you leave? Oh, he left. He left, guys. Ah, oh, there he goes. There he goes. <laughs> You hey, if you're still watching this, you, you got to stop doing. Look, I don't wish any bad on you, but you got to stop doing what you're doing, dude. People work really hard for their pages, and you fuckers, you bitches, keep coming in here trying to take people's... It doesn't belong to you. Now he's going to hack the YouTube. Hey, he can try. Him and his whole little posse, they can try, but I'm going to come I'm gonna come around and smack those bitches up, you know? I'm going to get them. We got them, baby. We got them. Let's go.
Woo! All right. Hey, while we're... <laughs> oh, I love it, dude. Hey, tell all your... If you're still watching, I know you fucking are, you little bitch. <laughs> and again, look, I'm just talking that playful shit. I don't wish any bad on you. I, I just want you to stop doing what you're doing. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, tell your tell your friends that have this job that they better stop or they better stop coming at me because I'm going to fucking expose each and every one of you when you guys come to me. I'm going to play dumb the whole way through and waste as much of your time as possible. And yeah, I, I'm going to make I'm going to make y'all's faces the thumbnail too. So what, after this video is done being live, I'm going to go back and make your face the thumbnail. And there's nothing you can do about it. There's not a damn thing you can do about it. So tell your friends, tell your boss to get his finger out of his butt for a minute and maybe change his career path. It's not even the career he's on. You guys are a bunch of idiots. No, no Nike is sponsoring any podcast. You guys got to work on your approach or just stop altogether. They call them, uh, Facebook calls them bad actors. These bad actors, I just call them like a bunch of bitches, bunch of bitch idiots, stupid idiot bitches, bad actors. But yeah, these bad actors will either pose as you by posting all your old content or posting different content that's not yours under your name, or they just will package your channel up and sell it to someone that, that might want that page to have it as their own kind of a thing. So uh, I'm very familiar with it, mainly because uh, my page, you know, yes, I love it too, Jorgen. And Jorgen's probably, Jorgen's been on my Facebook and on YouTube for a while, and about four or five years ago, I fell, you know, under the same kind of a scam and I lost my Facebook page. And then I was very fortunate enough to get it back. And when I did get it back, I went on to land an awesome deal through Facebook Gaming. It was one of the best jobs I ever had for about a year and a year and a half to two years. But if I never got that Facebook page back, I would have never had that income. And again, there's all these this young generation of content creators coming into the mix. Some probably have no idea that this stuff is even out there and they're going to keep kind of like evolving as time goes on. Like right now, they're a bunch of like robot idiot bitches. It's, it's probably going to take them 10 to 20 years to even like get a step better. They're just such bad. They're so bad at grammar. They're so bad at everything they do, as you guys could just see on this uh, video call right here. And again, I wish no bad on them. Um, you know, take care of your health first and foremost. But at, at the same time, y'all, you guys... Y'all are a bunch of bitches, man. Y'all y'all got to stop doing what you're doing. People work too hard for you guys to pull this shit. And I'm, I'm talking like he's still in here because I know he's still in here probably getting all of his boyfriends in here too to go over everything. I, ho I hope they keep coming back because I'm going to keep getting you fuckers too. And I think they will keep coming back because they're so stupid.